Jose Young's here with the MMA Fighting, speaking with Jan Blakowicz at the UFC 239 Media Day. Now, just a moment ago, you stared down with Luke Rockhold, uh, and he said some things to you. Do, what, what exactly did he say to you when you guys met face to face? That I've got small feet. So, I, 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 don't, I don't understand, like, what no, is that? But maybe he, you know, he, maybe they are small feet. I don't know, they are normal, but... Sure, we'll uh, We will see what he's gonna say when he's gonna feel my feet on his face, you know, in the Saturday. And all week he's been very dismissive of, dismissive of you. I mean, we've spoken to him and he's like, well, I'm fighting Jan, and he keeps bringing up John Jones. He's basically looking past you. What do you make of, what do you make of that and his attitude towards you all week? I don't care what he do, what he say. You know, I beat him in Saturday and after that just drink a beer and that's it. You know? So there's no animosity on your end? No, I'm too old for, you know, to, 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 to think about the, the, the shit what he's talking about. You know? And what do you make of his skill set? I mean, he was the 185 pound champion, but now he's moving up 20 pounds in weight. Three round fight. He's only fought one th three round fight in the UFC. Other than that, it's been all five rounds. What do you make of his skill set compared to past opponents? <laughs> we will see in Saturday, you know, but he's a big guy, you know, so... The size uh, will be almost the same, you know? uh, but you know, in two or five, his cardio is different, uh, the timing is different. We'll see how he's gonna make that. Uh, but I'm ready for everything. What you got for me? You know? What do you make of the state of the division as a whole right now? I mean, it's another 185er coming up. You have Thiago Santos, former 185er, Anthony Smith, former 185er. You've been around for a long time at 205. Is this? I beat Luke Rockhold. I could fight for the title next too. I believe in that, but first of all, I focus only about sure. Saturday. After the fight, we can talk about next challenge. And I do have to ask you, uh, um, a fighter you're, you've spent a lot of time in the cage, Jimmy Manoa just retired. Uh, uh, you didn't get that trilogy fight with him. Is that a disappointment? Are you happy that he's off in retirement, happy now? Or what, what do you make of his retirement? You know, I, I respect his, uh, that, that, he's on, uh, that he finished his career. I think he's a uh, good uh, decision. Uh, but never know. Maybe, maybe he will beg in future. We, we never know what's happened. Maybe he 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 gonna be boring on his retire and will try to beg again. We'll see. And go, I, I wish him best on on on, on his uh, new life. And going back to Luke, we spoke with him before you you guys came out, and I asked him like, what what do you how do you envision this fight? And he says, whatever I want, I'm gonna hit him early, and he. Like, he might not even last a round with me because I asked about the three rounds. He goes, he might not last a round. I'll pick him apart and expose him. What do you, how do you see the fight going? Knock him out in second round. Second round KO? Yeah. Good luck on Saturday. Easy. Appreciate, <laughs> appreciate you. Easy, but uh, uh, second round KO. Good luck.